Well, hello, glorious people of the interwebs, and welcome back to Ancestors the Humankind Odyssey. It's another beautiful sunrise, and today we're going to work on evolving into the next iteration of the species. Hopefully we're going to be evolving into Lucy today. I'm not 100% sure if we're going to make it. We're going to be working on it. And we've been hanging out here in the savannah for quite some time now. We've got a really nice oasis camp here. But there is some more things over there that I want to explore. And uh, see if anything good can be unlocked. Uh, we're also going to be hunting down an elephant today. We didn't get to actually kill one in the previous episode. We're going to see if we can take it down and see if it has any special parts that we can use to help our evolution. And we're also going to need to breed, which is what we need to do right now. We need to get our groove on. We need to find some frisky, frisky monkeys and get some uh, spontaneous mutations. I'm actually at the point right now where I need spontaneous mutations to really progress much further in our uh, neural trees. So that's really what we're going to be working on a lot today, which will hopefully help us evolve as well, because the more babies we have, the better our evolutionary jump will be. But thank you all so much for the absolutely insane amount of support everyone has provided on this series. I never expected it to be this popular, and uh, I am humbled. So thank you all so much for the support, and I, I hope we enjoy this episode. I don't know what's going to happen yet, but we got some frisky monkey business going on. Right now, I'm really looking for uh, bipedal mutations and... Um, what is it? It's the the stomach mutations. I don't know why I'm drawing a blank all of a sudden, but let's see what we got. Did we get one? Ooh. Ah, dexterity mutation. Okay, that's not bad. That's still a good one. That'll help us craft things easier. And some pretty bad luck on the mutations this round, but I do want to lock in the ones that we do have. And we need to... This is going to get locked in on our next evolution. This one... We need to reach adulthood for that one. And I think we have one more, maybe, that we need to get. I looked at... Oh, no, this is the one here. Uh, so this will lock in after the next evolution. Uh, but if we if we go to another generation, I think we're going to lose it. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and evolve now. And I don't know if we're going to get into the next species on this round. There, we did unlock quite a few things. Um... But let's, yeah, let's see what happens. Evolutionary leap time, baby. Do it. Let's see how many years we go. We're at 4,500 years right now. Nice. Plus 5,000 years ahead of time on that one. We did find quite a few things. We fought a bunch of stuff too, so that should really give us a nice boost. Uh, I wanted to breed a little bit more before doing this, but I also want to make sure we lock in any mutations so that way we don't accidentally lose any. Nice. Yeah, so we got a lot of these combat ones, which give a lot of years and a lot of bonus ones. Oh, we got 7,500 extra years on that one. So we got a 25,000 year ahead of time bonus right now. We're now 1.3 million times or million years faster than science at the moment. And we moved 177,000 years. And we had 12 births. We get an extra 60,000 years. And zero deaths. Evolving faster than science, back to game. Did we evolve our features at all? Oh, where are we? I have never been here. We didn't evolve our features at all, which I'm okay with. I figured we weren't going to get another kind of jump in our features to Lucy. Probably until around the 2 million year range would be my guess. But it looks like we got good water here. We got uh, an okay number of food sources. Do we have any aloe here? Okay, so our last base was actually... Oh, no. Oh, we're really far away. Okay, so that's where all the elephants are over there. Um, oh, man, we are so far from where we were last time. I hope there's some aloe here. That's really going to help us survive a little bit better. We got all of our babies everywhere. You know what? Let's, let's bring everybody in. Make sure... Oh, you know what? This is the first time we've actually had all of our babies in, like, one spot. It's a Christmas miracle. That, like, never happens. The last few times I've evolved, it's like they've thrown them all over the place. Sometimes they're getting eaten by snakes when I can finally grab them. It's, it's, it's absurd. 
This is getting a little ridiculous, but we, thankfully we got all of our babies. We're gonna have to stock up on some aloe here, and now, since we're here, we can hunt down an elephant. I haven't found any aloe here yet. I haven't really been looking. I've been trying to uh, eat some meat to get that omnivore trait, but I found some hippos, and we have not fought a hippo yet. I'm feeling pretty brave today. Hopefully they're not hungry, hungry hippos. Do you want to go, bro? Springbrock? Spring, spring, springbrock! I know that's not what it is, but the hunters got me excited about springbok. Springbaku! Want to go, hippo? Hip Hop Anonymous? Oh, God. Ugh. Real. Oh! Oh, Super Arby is back, baby! Super Arby. Or Arby. <laughs> Super Arby one shot the Hip Hop Anonymous. Oh, God. Hi. Hi. Oh, you're going to get rocked, baby! The Basalt Chopper! I break it? Oh no. Yeah, get out of here. Ah! Oh! <laughs> oh, get rocked, baby. Club Artie is back. Beautiful. Also making a Club Artie shirt because I think it would be amazing. Did I break my stone though? Nope. <laughs> Got all the meat an Artie could hope for. This is amazing. It's going to be a while before we evolve into Lucy. I was saying we're going to get that done today, but honestly, we might not be able to. But we're going to have a lot of other fun, which is good. Okay, other hippo. Very mad. I must have killed its hippo friend. Uh, all I have is a stone. Oh, God. Ow. 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 Oh, my bones. Artie. Oh, oh God. Artie bones hurt. Oh. Do not fight hippo with rock. It's a bad idea. Come on, Artie. Let's go. Trying to power through eating the flesh of my enemies to unlock some neuron mutations so I can eat these more often. You trying to come after me, Spring Blacku? Oh, 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 no! Bad hippo! Bad! I didn't even eat your hippo, friend! Jeez, they're so angry. <laughs> Hip Hop Anonymous trying to murder Artie. Good lord, but yeah, so you gotta power through that stomach bug to really get that omnivore trait. Uh, so I'm just gonna kinda eat as much meat as I can and hope that I finally unlock the trait. I know we gotta get some genetic mutation stuff too, um, but things are still looking pretty good. Ooh, we finally got a metabolism mutation. I had a brain fart for a second, so... I wasn't getting any mutations, and I know there's a few glitches in the game, but I wasn't getting any mutations for like four generations. And I decided I just restarted the um, the game. I restarted the Epic. There's been no update. The second I restarted, I started getting mutations again. And that's how I fixed this broken one here. And I, I've been saying like this whole area here has not been, I've not been getting anything for any of this. So I think it's been glitched out. And now that I finally got a mutation here, I think we can finally start getting our metabolism where it's supposed to be. I'm super duper excited now. So if you guys are playing this and you have any issues, make sure to restart your game every once in a while if something just doesn't seem right or you're not progressing at the pace you think you should. Don't be like me and just keep your game on all the time because you might be tempted to. Let's see if we get another mutation here. Maybe we'll get lucky. I'd like to have, like, a heat resistance mutation. I don't know if that's ever going to happen, though. Give this a little skipperoo. And... No. Okay. I'm glad I got one, though. That that metabolism mutation is going to be super duper good. We have now actually got some legitimately good mutations right now. And we got two, like, motricity ones. So that should really help us with our bipedal issues that we've been having. And we're about to evolve once we have a couple more babies. Just figuring I'd bring it back, see if we get any more mutations while we're doing this. Of course, I'm bringing it back and we don't get one. How unlucky is that? But I do want to show off. Uh, you can see down at the bottom right all the mutations that we have. It's about time we actually evolve. I don't think we're going to skip far enough to get really any pro. Ooh, there's another one. Self control one. Ooh. Those are like my favorite because it really makes fighting predators extremely easy like you guys have seen where you know i could pretty much take down anything without getting afraid anymore and i highly recommend taking advantage of those mutations when you get them because it really helps you out in the long run 
We find another male that's not in the family. That was a female, though, uh, but still. Family related. Oh, uh, oh, an elder male. Uh-oh. Abu. Ladies and gentlemen of the interwebs, it's time to evolve. 36 babies, which means we should get a couple hundred years on this. Probably not more than that, because I didn't really do anything else. We're going to lock in all these mutations, which should really give us an advantage here soon. Oh, we did kill, kill a hip-hop anonymous. <laughs> so used to calling it my funny names, and I forgot how to speak English for a second. 36 births. 180,000 years. Oh, almost at 4 million. We're getting there. Slowly but surely. We're definitely evolving faster than science. Like, way faster. Hopefully we don't end up somewhere too crazy here. Oh. Uh, is this the swamp one? No, it's not the swamp one. I don't even know where I am. Oh, I know where I am. That big tree over in the, in the back there is where we were living before. I think. Maybe I don't know where I am. I'm lost and I don't know what's going on. Is there anything to discover here? Yep. At least all the babies aren't getting eaten. That's that's a good sign. <laughs> Got to our new settlement and there was a sacrifice there waiting for us. Well, it's really our old settlement. But something decided it was a bright idea to try and take it over. So we took its soul. Wait, where'd it go? There it is. So now we've got sustenance for us. But I wanted to check out what we unlocked with our evolution since we've locked them in now. So we've got stability control, the ability to maintain balance in walking shallow water is increased. Perfect. Uh, nutrient absorption, more energy is gained per food portion. Very nice. And we're finally unlocking this whole side that I've been talking about we haven't been able to do. Uh, so we got orientation again. Manual dexterity. Fewer hits are required to successfully craft items using a tool. That is awesome. And willpower. All threats induce less fear. That is what I'm talking Oh my god. We, we have done so much now. There we go. So we still need a genetic mutation for some of this. Uh, consumption is required. There we go. Now we are finally going to become the omnivore. We've supposed to have been for so long, but this was like, it just wasn't working for some reason. Oh, we unlocked it! Finally! Oh, sweet baby Jesus! Oh, we got it from drinking water, too, which is ridiculous. Um, we need to unlock that. That. Where is my bed? <laughs> Big brain monkey has lost its bed. Okay. We have been trying to unlock this for so long, it's not even funny. So, acclimated... <laughs> <laughs> Mammal food acclimatization. Oh my god. I know how to say this word. Apparently I can't read it. Uh, <laughs> let's see if we can actually learn it with the neuron energy that we have. And then hopefully we can eat meat without getting sick. Symptoms following the ingestion of meat from mammals are less severe. And we should be able to continuously expand this to make things so much better. Oh, don't make fun of me for my pronunciation of... I, I'm not even going to say it again. I just give up with life right now. It's going to butcher me some meat. Like, I can say acclimated, but apparently I can't say acclimatization. Oh my god, I did it. Christmas miracle! Eat more meat! I'm so happy that my stuff is not glitched out anymore, or that I finally got the mutation that I needed to get it to work. Some of it was glitched out, but now I got the mutation, and I'm unlocking so much stuff on this side. Like, this is so useful. The shield duration against all poisonings and injuries is longer. Uh, we've got this over here. The recovery time from poisoning or injury is now faster. Like, unlocking so much stuff with our metabolism. Basically, anytime I touch my body with something new, I unlock a new neuron, which is great. So, and I can also, like, alter sticks in one hit now, too. Uh, but regardless, I wanted to do some exploration over here. We got one of our males. I don't want anybody else to follow me. just want to make sure I have two babies. And let's see if we can walk a little bit faster. We can sprint while while standing up now, too, which is nice. Unfortunately, we can't do it for a terribly long time. But I want to go over to this rock over here, because I've heard rumors there's a special stone. Now, we haven't had the Emerald of Destiny on us in a while. We do need to go get it, because it's in a settlement way over there in the jungle. It's not terribly far away. It'll probably take like an hour to get there and back. 
but we need the Emerald of Destiny. We can't evolve, evolve into Lucy without having the Emerald of Destiny. It's going to help us on our path. We cannot submit to the dark side, ladies and gentlemen. We just can't. But I want to see what's over here because we've gotten the the <laughs> Blue Bay, the Emerald of Destiny, Tourmaline, and I think that's it. So there should be like one or two more different kinds. One of them is supposed to be over here on this big old jutty out rock of awesomeness. Where are you, my precious? I don't hear you yet, trying to whisper sweet nothings into my big ape brain. Uh, well, maybe I do hear something. I think it's up here, because we, we kind of ran past this in a previous episode, and I did think I heard something. Oh yeah, there's definitely something up here. Way at the tippity-tippity top. Now, there was, at some point, meteors here, and then I evolved and they disappeared, so apparently I lost the chance to get them. I don't even know when they landed. Oh, there's, like... Some... Oh. Oh, something's up here. It's a big bird of doom. Ah! Ah! Oh! Who's dead? One shot the douche bird. You get! Stay in the air, stupid. That's why there ain't no big birds, because you're so dumb. You stop flying. It's like an Argentavis. Hello. <gasps> Ooh, hello, my precious. Oh, the Ruby of Salvation. This goes hand in hand with the Emerald of Destiny. You have both. You unlock the true human form. Yes, and the monkey's like, what are you talking about? Stupid. <laughs> oh, man, we're going to eat some bird flesh. It's going to be great. Found a ruby. It's a precious stone. We did it. This is a really pretty, pretty, pretty thing, actually. Look at this thing. It's majestic. It looks like a heart. I love it. It's bay. Red bay. <laughs> All right. Let's eat some, eat some lovely bird flesh. Oh, Oh my god, the hyenas took it down? I thought we were going to see some hyena bison murder action. Or buffalo, or whatever you want to call it. Um, but I had to go get some aloe vera. Fortunately, I haven't been able to find any. That bison, buffalo thing. Rest in spaghetti, never forgetty. <laughs> you know what I want to do? Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah. I want to bash a hyena over the head with our new ruby. Oh, yes! <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> they keep coming. You want some, bro? Oh, it's on like Donkey Kong. Go to sleep, son. You want a mess? See? The ruby does protect. Maybe not as well as the emerald. But in, when they can work together, yeah, we're going to evolve. <laughs> Losing my mind. Creating a religion around precious stones. I feel, like, I feel like they would do this, though, you know? Definitely would happen. Can we? I don't want to hit a bison with this, but I do want to get the extra points. You want to go, bro? Oh, this is going to be so bad. Oh! Oh! Arty leg. Much pain. Struggle. The pain. I knew it was a bad idea. Why'd you guys make me do that? We need to find an altar for the ruby and the emerald. At some point, we're going to make an expedition to go get our emerald back. Uh, let's see. I guess... Here's not too bad. Put it there. And we can put the emerald here. And then we'll throw the, the tourmaline or tourmaline back that way somewhere. <laughs> We must keep the evil away from us. We also need to find some more meteorites. We dropped them once when we got attacked by a whole bunch of things way back when. But progression has been amazing right now. So let's just show off everything that we've unlocked. I'm just unlocking so much stuff. I've been playing through the majority of this game without a lot of the stuff that makes surviving exponentially easier. Uh, so once connected, it'll be fast to recover from an injury, which is great. Go ahead and burn that bad boy in. And then we've got all of these down here. Like this one here. Metabolism. 
Uh, we can make it possibly protected against uh, hemorrhages for a longer time. Very nice. There won't be bleeding out as easily. And I'm sure there's probably one for the heat, too. So toxin immunity. Nice. That one, the protection against in, uh, intoxication is longer. So we're making ourselves significantly more survivable. I'm just so sad that I didn't unlock any of these sooner. Oh my god, just a game changer. And then sensory memory. Nice. We're making a lot of progression now. Uh, really, the goal is going to be exploring a little bit more and unlocking a bunch of stuff that's going to allow us to be able to get to... Ooh, the quality of food sources is faster. Okay, that's not too huge. Uh, but it does help out a little bit. Although we're not going to be really finding any new food sources for a while. Because we've pretty much explored most of the area. We can still get to the ocean, which we need to do. Also, I had an ape die of old age, which kind of sucked. Uh, but it is what it is. <laughs> He's just chilling there. But thank you all so much for watching. I do hope you all enjoyed the episode. Thank you so much for the support on the series. It's been amazing. And keep an eye out for new series on the channel. Obviously, we still got a lot to play of this. But there's so many new games coming out in the coming weeks and months, especially Planet Zoo in November. But thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.